All right, so as promised, uh, while I start talking, you guys can go out and do some shopping. Hell yes, my you favorite activity. To, you shouldn't need to move your icon, I don't think, but I think you I made this. Oh, oh, wait, they're probably all closed. Let me open them. I mean, you also got to pause the game, but yeah. Uh, no, you No, no, no. There we go. Um, so um, two, I added yeah, okay. another shop. I updated the shop slightly. There's not too much of an update, but there is some changes, so I think you should still check them out. Um, but yeah. Luck is a luck pop. What the f yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, can't read the easy. description of the autumn. I, I mean, that's, is that you intended? that's intentional. <laughs> but yeah, yeah there, there are some items that you guys might not know. Um, um, but so last time you guys, I'll buy a bag of twenty caltrops. <laughs> you guys got back to Ekron. Uh, how you turned in your quest and you met with Zinc. Uh, you heard about some uh, orcs near water causing some trouble now, and also you guys just wanted to look at the. You had been hinted about some bones by the uh by one of the witches so you decided to check that out where you guys met some ghost snakes and you fought some vampire kobolds but yeah so as promised last time you guys can go ahead do a little bit of shopping uh before we officially start today some nice arrows in there i did Which update one? shops a little bit yeah. go on the right he has acid ice mage fire and walloping Ooh, I don't have ice. But yeah, but um, eventually I do plan to just completely change shops and like get more stuff even. But that means I have to import so much craziness. But um, I think this is a good little start. And if there's anything, you can pretend to talk to the NPCs to find out. I assume this ice arrow does ice damage. Uh, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> probably? Question mark. Uh, did actually... Let me let me open stuff up. But yeah. Did I actually get my inventory? I did not. Is that broken right now? What? I took I my gold. I haven't changed anything, so technically nothing should be broken. I just yeah, it means not in my inventory. Did you try and buy one? I did buy one. If you go to Terra, the Whistling Hammer, the guy on the right, is the Ice Arrow clock crossed out for you guys? Zero left? Mm. Yeah, there's zero. Yeah, so I, I bought it, but it's, yeah, it's not my inventory. Um, it might be just, like, way further down in your... Let me see your inventory. Nary. I... Uh, mine. That... Oh, what the heck? It yeah. didn't go in your inventory. I'll add it to your inventory. That's going in Zakun's inventory? No, I didn't. He doesn't have an inventory. Uh, okay, you should have one now. Yep. No, I, no clue why that didn't go there. I see it now. Let's see. So I need to also. I'm gonna also pick up that mage fire. You'll probably also have to add this. Let me know if. No, that one added. added. Okay. okay. Whatever. Interesting. Uh, and I don't have a walloping, so I'll buy one of those. Actually, I don't have an acid arrow either. I have a poison arrow, but not an acid. It's so hard. Like, what do you give the punching guy? I mean, do you? I, mean, I still I have, have that amulet. Do you want that, like, the giant's kin amulet thing? Didn't that, like, literally do nothing for me, if I'm not mistaken? Yeah, uh, it was like an extra rage mm -hmm. charge or something, basically. You don't really need it if you just, oh, like, yeah, conserve yeah, your resources. Yeah. Oh yeah, it doesn't actually get yeah, it doesn't actually give you strength. Yeah. Oh my buckler never made my inventory either. Cause I remember I bought that last time and it never showed up. You wanna just add that to mine? Buckler? Yeah. Wait, what's or... the difference with the buckler? Ah, I just didn't have a out. These are actually a little bit different than I think. Uh but here you go. Thank you. Is there is there a way for me to read an item before I buy it or no? No. You gotta no. ask. Okay. okay. I'm trying to think yeah, is there anything else? Talk to the shopkeepers. That we need here. Like this lady's literally got pots of iron. What the fuck does that mean? They're just iron pots, what do you mean? Hmm. 
Wasn't there something I could do with a hunting trap? I'm trying to remember. No, I was just a. No, no that was a spell. Never mind. <clears throat> da, da, da. Yeah, I think I might be good for now. I don't know if anyone else is. I can't wait for you to I do some things. And then I know think I'm good. good. Well, I just don't. I mean, the one thing I'd get, it's like a one time use thing. Is it? Is it though? Yeah, the potion of um, growth. But I also don't have enough. Just get money, Kappa. Yeah. All right. If you guys are all good, uh, are you all good there? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. All right. With that. You guys left off <coughs> at. Uh, oh, dude, my HP's like fucking cursed still. I forgot. Jesus. Yeah, some of you oh, shit. Yeah. Cursed. Didn't we just have to. Um, wasn't this a long. No, we haven't done a long rest yet because we're still doing this. And, and I don't know about that. Uh, is that what he said? I don't think we yes. ever learned anything about it. Here. No, I think that's just what we're assuming. Well, so yeah, yeah I I had like a bunch of shit, but it was ruled that it wouldn't work. Oh shit, I forgot. Uh, my Zakun was lightning, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I just wanted to make so note yeah, of that. This is where you guys left off. You fought those um, vampire kobolds in front of these ghost snakes um, who had mentioned that there were like other enemies nearby. They had mentioned that nearby it was. Right. Uh, they were sailing towards uh, a Yonti treasure or trove or something of that sort of something that they believed was important to them um they were sailing there and yeah this is kind of where we left off so what would you guys like to be doing they told us to go south to get to the place um but you guys are kind of low so what do we do about that well i'm not actually low i'm like artificially low yeah, I'm at. That's the <laughs> effectively the same thing. Let's be honest here. Yeah, uh, half health. I'm only missing twelve, and I'm at full HP for what yeah, I can be right now. Also did I'm a fine. Short rest was the plan. Yes. Uh, but, yeah. yeah, we did that the last at the last session. Yeah. I'm good to keep going on. Um, I mean, I guess yeah. If it's up to Tobias, if we want to <laughs> continue to push forward. I think I'm only actually like. I mean. I effectively have 31 HP. That's like half me. Yeah. But I can... I still have both my rages, though. Um, okay, so Tobias, Tobias will say, like, uh, in response, like, oh, whatever that thing did to me is making me not feel too good, but uh, I I'm down to keep fighting, just might need to take a break in between fights here and there. Well, it's not always assured, is the only thing. That's fine. Alright, you on your head there. be it. Let's go south. Mm -hmm. So, as you all continue down south, the uh, waves of the ocean keep hitting, you know, the beach. So that nice uh, air, the little water particles <clears throat> splash on your face. It's so relaxing. Maybe one day when there's peace and you're not, you know, under a contract, you'll have time to... Uh, Go and have a beach on. But you all continue down. Uh, continue trying to find a, a cave on the side. To which point, and, and you have seen uh, footprints previously, so you also follow those footprints. Uh, to which point you eventually find a fairly large opening um, on the side of this, I don't want to say beach, but or like, Imagine, like, you know, kind of like this gap, but there you find a very large opening uh, in the wall. 
Okay, I'm gonna cool. ask again. Is there? Yeah, can I see if there's like what kind of tracks are coming in and out of this? Uh, go ahead and make a um, survival check. For sure, for sure, for sure. For good. So as you look at the tracks, you know they're quite a bit larger than your own feet, um, but you know some of them are a bit smaller as well. Like you see the tracks of um, creatures that, like, given that you guys just saw the kobolds come at you, you do see tracks um, that match those that came towards you. But you also see ones that are much larger and nary with your, you know, experience and everything that happened in Fandle. And you do see that there are some orc and ogre tracks as well. Well, I think we're on the right path then, certainly. Do we need oh. to, like... <clears throat> Do any prep before we go in here? Do we have any, like, spells that would assist us, pass without trace, anything like that? I'll have a look at my spell book. Holy, I have a lot of cantrips. I got hands the, wait, the triple multi-class is a lot of cantrips? No fucking... Yeah, crazy. <laughs> crazy that. <laughs> um, I, I don't really have anything that would help, I don't believe. Yeah, I mean, I, I could enhance ability if we knew what we were up against, but... I mean, I could alter self and look like a fucking orc or something, but we don't know what the deal is with these guys, so. Try to be sneaky going in there? I don't know that there's terribly much point. Um, yeah, I think we should be sneaky. The point, the, the much point was the my own alter self thing. So I could cast Bear's Endurance on um, Tobias. I'd get you an extra 2d6 temporary hit points and advantage on con saves, but that doesn't probably matter. But the extra temp hit points. I mean, that sounds kind of nice. I can for sure do that. Yeah. But, um, I mean, depending on how long they last is the thing. Like it's an hour. Like, it might be better to, like, do that before we know something bad, unless we know that the bad thing is in here, just depends I mean, I, on I, how much foresight we have. I kind of assume that there's going to be a bad thing in here, just because of the tracks and kind of, the, you know, the contract we're on to find the, the orcs. Yeah. And they're, like, guys over there that told us that, the, that these yeah. guys are bad, too. Right, go for that's... it, then. If we, think, if we think we're close enough, that's fine. Yeah, I think we are. Two six. So, fucking Christ, dude. That, that is crazy. crazy. That's crazy. Uh, <laughs> I see. I see all of this going on, and I just cast Armor of Agathus on myself, and with my single Warlock spell slot, and get more temp HP than that. Okay. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> this is dumb. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, who's gone first? Who's sneaky? Who's a sneaky snake? I mean, I'm decently I'm sneaky. Pre I'm, pre I'm pretty sneaky. I got like a plus six. If how sneaky you were was started at zero, and then whether you were good or bad was quantified <laughs> by single individual multi uh, uh, addition or subtraction from the zero, I would be like a plus two. I'd be a plus four. <laughs> Alright, well, <clears throat> sounds like it should be Tobias, and then me, and then Neri. Probably Ooh. mainly Neri just at the back, so he can shoot people. Good shoot. That works. And then, oh, wait, where's the coon? Yeah, what's his? The coon's not real. What do you mean? How big's the opening, by the way? Um, it is, like, maybe about 12 feet wide. It's a pretty large opening. And I would say about like not uh, eight to ten feet tall as well. I mean, it looks like a pretty standard cave. Yeah. I was just wondering, you know, if I could walk along the roof, you know. I mean, probably. But like, as I peek my head in, is it like does the cave open up more wide, or is it kind of like a narrow, like so you twelve twelve foot in, tall tunnel? You initially don't see much. Um, but it is very narrow visioned, and as you look up, you see that there are walls, like, walls going all the way up. Okay. Well, um, I would like to, uh, 
sneak, sneakily lead the way. Go ahead and make a spell check. All of us are just in. Um, well, whoever wants to be sneaky. I was so close to it. I mean, I want to be sneaky. I definitely want to be sneaky. Oh, wait, I have the, um, da, da, da. would you say? I'll put you guys in, but keep talking. Would you say that this stealth check uh, relies on us moving silently? Um, <laughs> <yes>. <laughs> I mean, I would say, yeah. Yeah, that's just a very, like... <laughs> I rolled it? No, I didn't. Okay. Wait, no. Oh, I thought you rolled the same thing twice. No. I was like, dang, homie rolled advantage. Let's roll two times. Oh, fuck. Is it dark in here? Oh no, how ter- uh, yeah, don't worry, I'm gonna fix it in a minute. Okay. But, um, yes- Wait, you don't have dark vision? Imagine nah. dark vision, it's almost as if my- Damn, dude, it's light. almost like there was a scroll of, like, dark vision, I think, in the sh- Yeah, but Sakuna has dark vision, so whatever. <laughs> uh, if I do this, and then- I'll just, he'll just be Wait, my guide. This doesn't give you guys oh, yeah. everything, right? This is just what you currently see, right? Yeah, it's, we can see like this entry room in here, and that's about it. Perfect. Like you forgot the wall on like the bottom it's section. It's funny but... as there should be walls there. Yeah. Oh no, I know why there's um, vision there. Wait. Yeah, like I, I can see you like vision there. That's. Weird. I can see a little bit there and a little bit there. Wait, why is there a vision there? there? That's so weird. A little bit there. Huh? Here and here. What if I draw? Actually, I have no clue why you can... Oh, wait, no, I know why. Ugh. Okay, if I do this... Did that change anything? <clears throat> why can you see there? That's so weird. You're not supposed to. <laughs> but do I care? Um... This... Kind of just sounds like a problem that I don't really care too much about. It's fine. Well, that's fine. But yeah, so as you guys enter, you see that um, the large hole, like, immediately in front of you is a wall. But you can see that it diverts into two little pathways that diverts into a much larger In the center of this room, there is a large burning fire pit. Um, and then there are four fairly large columns as well in this room that have chains going off to the side. You also see within this room, in one in front and two, um, one on each side, are large gates that are all the way down. You also see various spikes all across this room. Um, and of course, because it's a dungeon, there are various bones all across the ground. Lovely. Um, wait, wait, so you said all, uh, or the three gates down? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, yeah, they're all down. Okay. I mean, um, do you see anyone in this main room here, or is it... As of right now, you do not see any creatures in this room. Okay. Or here. Or here. I'm gonna begin to walk in a little bit. And maybe I'll just kind of hug the wall as I yeah, so, and, and gently as feel up on this door. You, around, you normally would like to climb across the walls, you know, find some easy mm -hmm. path. But you see that these walls go all the way to the ceiling, which isn't crazy high. It's maybe at most 15 feet up. Oh, cool. But yeah, I just kind of want to see if I can, like, is it like a drop down gate? Is there a lever when I get here? Like, what's up? As you look, you don't see anything but you like you don't see like some sort of lever um okay there. can i try and like lift it or uh, i want to do a try a little quiet a little, a little quietly a strength check, a strength check. okay uh, if you're trying to do it quietly i'm actually gonna have you make it with wait no i'll just make it harder yeah go ahead and make it make it yeah i'm not good at it anyway so Okay, yeah, you try mm -hmm. to, like, go from the ground and try to lift it up, but you start straining yourself, and you feel if you try even more, um, your your arms are just going to burst. Uh, yeah, so there are walls. You will need to be probably using WASD to move around, just in case. Um, I'm not 100% sure, um, but yeah. 
but as of right now, like, and, and the reason you know that there's gate is like different material. Um, in, yeah. What is the plan here? Or for the gate, is it like, are they like bars? Like, can I see through it, or is it no, kind of like they're of meshed metallic. enough to it's where like, it's a solid metal um, gate? Mm. I'll, I'll kind of like come come back and oop shit and whisper. Why is it moving me diagonal? I'm literally clicking down. That's weird. Um, I'll whisper like, I, I can't seem to lift this one. You want to try to help one, or uh, you want to help yeah, on could... that? Uh, I could try a different one. Okay. And I could, you know, offer Zakun some help. He's pretty strong. May I try and lift this door? And maybe I'm a little bit frustrated. I'm, I'm a little less, uh, I'm not trying to be as quiet about it. Right, go ahead and make and I'm going to have Zakun help, too. Okay. He see he saw him struggle with the last can one. Use the help action. Sure. I'm pretty sure he can. Yeah, that's fine. I don't see why he wouldn't. Wait, that was this. Wait, what? Athletics. Okay. So, as what's my roll? You rolled uh, athletics. Oh, did you last time you rolled strength flat? Did you mean to? I mean, it's want me to... not going to be that much of a difference, right? Okay, yeah, let me. Know. I... Yeah, I didn't. Yeah. yeah, my bad. I didn't realize. Um. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, so as you try lifting it up, um, you're able to, like, get it just a little bit in Zakun, like, uses his large um, mouth that can eat anything, starts helping, shoving it up a little bit. You're able to lift it up just a slight bit, and you need to be, um, maybe Tobias, and to be, like, a little bit of a squeezed nary in Zakun, you could very... Do I have to hold the time? As you let go and try to like, let Zakun hold on to it, that it's staying put. Okay. I guess we'll keep that there then. So if we open the open door and it's open. Yeah, I will do that for you guys. There you go. Go ahead and you should be able to open it. Wait, I can't go inside okay. necessarily. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll motion over with my head to Nary to like crawl under and, and scout ahead. Um, I think the door will hold it. Just take a look real quick. Yeah. Zakun and I slide under. As you guys slide underneath, you find more walls. Ah. Uh. I'm a. Yeah, I'm gonna go here. And I'll say, okay, I'll keep a look at it if you guys want to crawl underneath. I, so I say that mentally to Tobias. I'll, uh, I'll um, motion over to Cecily to come over as well. Alrighty. It seems like it'll be amazing. I'll, I'll be in right after you. You're up. So, You're up. <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> I haven't been paying terribly as much attention as I should be. Is this door. In, in any way, a door that can just like lock us in here. It is. A uh, no, it didn't it seem up. like it. I lifted it up, and it's it's holding for the time being. Like if I, if I were to let go, like it's it's still holding as as much up as it'll go. But we had to crawl under. Like I, right. I couldn't. So like, it's like a stone. It it's like a stone slab that like descends from the ceiling type deal. <clears throat> Absolutely classic door that can trap us in here. By the way, just for future reference, Tobias, this is like. You go in the maze yeah, was... and the door pulls down and you're trapped in. Can I have oh. one of I don't really think I have a anything. Nature to... check for me, please. A nature check. Anyone? Anyone. I don't care who. I'm not doing that shit. <clears throat> I am utterly neutral at nature. I uh, I don't think I have anything to prop the door open. Um, I'm really awful. I, I am I am negative nature. Okay. Yeah, same. <laughs> yeah, I don't have much that I would trust holding up a stone slab other than my magic sword because it's really hard to break magic items, but I'm not leaving that shit here, so. Uh, just checking my spells to see if I have anything that can. Uh, like, go around it, maybe? 
I mean, I could shove my shovel in that opening. I don't know if we pull it open. <laughs> a shovel. It's I mean, um, considering how hard it was to open, I, I imagine it probably wouldn't help too much. No. Um, as, uh, is there like a button or a side, lever? I could just summon an unseen servant the, on the, the other one, side. There isn't on our side, so I was just about to ask that to Nary, actually. Is, is there any mechanism on your side? Do I see any? Looking around? Uh, currently do not. Okay. Um, yeah, so gonna... I, I, I won't get out if uh, without like a long rest and changing spells to pick up uh, something different, I, I wouldn't think. Uh, worst comes Even worst then, I don't know what I can get a little, I actually. I can get a little angry and try and can I, um, open it a little easier. Can but... I peek over here and so, take another look and see if there's a... Ah! Because they got spooked by you. And they fly they go towards Sukun. They fly underneath the gate. Um, they fly past Setsuo and Tobias as well and outside. But you do find a little um, lever on the side here. I'm a... Well, I should probably yell. Is there any point in investigating it? I assume it operates the door. Look, <clears throat> is there any, like, bits of metal or wood and shit around here? Is this, is this stuff or not really? Yeah, uh, Any of the spikes metal? Um, I'll say, I'll say they all are. Okay, well, just, can we just, uh, are they, like, stuck into the, like, are yeah, they so lodged, they or are they, go, like... But the walls are... Alright, well, <clears throat> I do the, the easiest solution that would take the longest in-game, and I go out to the beach and I get a big rock, and I put it under the door. <laughs> and I crawl through the other side. Is that alright? That's what you want to do. Okay, cool. That's what you want I do, do that. Uh, I'll start to, like, gently lower the, the metal door slab and, and see kind of, like, how well the rock's, like, holding up. The rock is holding it. Okay. Uh, well, alright, and I'll crawl through. Alright, so you guys have all crawled through to the other side. How, we How do you want us to go about this? Do you want 30 foot of movement at a time, or what do you, you, what you want? You guys want to use your... Just sure. not, don't like rush, you know? Yeah, yeah. Through it, oh, oh, can... Talk about... <laughs> Going on in your head as you walk in. Try to yeah. stick to his. Are, are we using same stealth rolls from before? Okay. Oh, I, oh did, I, did I even roll stealth? Given that he got a little angry, reduced slightly. Yeah, I got angry. Oh, dang. Yeah. Well, because when you were trying to, like, to be you like said that. you were, like, a little bit more angry when you lifted it up, so kind of reduced your stealth score. Yeah. <laughs> Valid. But yeah, as you guys begin walking around, you can all see. You know, it's definitely some sort of maze. The um, go all the way up. Um, thought process going. I'm gonna... My thought process is we should choose one side and stick to it yeah, the yeah. way. I was gonna say I'm gonna hug the right side and see if I can find out where that gate ended up on the other side that we didn't touch. I'm, I'm, well, given that in, in canon, I wouldn't be able to see that this side more likely goes deeper, I'm happy to stick to the right. It's a 50-50, so let's yeah, just stick to the right. Hug and, the, and hug the right wall from, yeah, and kind of just let's do like that. This. I'm and happy. I, like, come down here. Do I see anything? So as you go Like, in the, in the little there, cubby, obviously. Kind of just I'm just basically, like, running mine along the right wall, right, right. just to, like... You just find a dead end. Um, and like, okay. as you guys are walking going. through, and like any dead ends you find, you do very, uh, genuinely find like various um, skeletons and such. Mm. Um, Wonder how they got chopped here. But yeah. Okay. 
I'll keep going on, holding the the right wall. As you keep, you know, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I can see down here. It's like there's nothing. Uh, I will say, so I just keep going. Oh. You do find another. Um... Find a uh, Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um, everything I'm hold seeing on, on the map, I'm not supposed to see correctly. Like, we we shouldn't be going down here. We should be going along here. If no, we're I know. The wall. Yeah, no, I'm saying I can see the end of the hallway and I see the lever. So it's just more like I'm I'm like I'm seeing. It. Why do you see that? That is so interesting. Yeah, I don't know. I was like, know. thing. No, 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 that's the lever. Oh, okay. I, no, I was saying the, um... I, I can see over here for some reason. Yeah, I realize. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's changed now. But yeah, I'll keep going. I, I, I acknowledge the lever. I'll, I'll, I'll point out to Cecily that the lever's over there without saying anything. And I, I notice that the gate's right here on the other side. Correct. So Correct. we've we've effectively, you know, found my destination. But I, I, I keep going onward. Um... And as I get here, I see like a long opening going upward. I don't necessarily go up there, but I, I, I see it. Yeah, you do see a long um, opening where you could go up. Um, but you do see as well that you could just keep going to the direction that you're going. Mm -hmm. I'll keep doing that for now. Um, that is so weird that it doesn't... Okay. I don't even know. I mean... You know, yeah. I'll, I'll go in this um, way, but yeah. I'll, I'll mention, yeah, like, yeah, someone yeah, to go yeah, around yeah. the corner really quick just to, like, take the peek, peek around the, the back corner. If that's the if you want to go look over there really quick. Over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, just, something like this, like, so far, from what you guys have seen, like, it's fairly empty. Um, so, now we're going to discuss that natural nary. Yes. You are one with nature. You are what one might call... Oh, I don't know, a ranger. Mm -hmm. um, you feel, you know, you're a bit in tune with the earth and your surroundings. But you feel as if deep down underneath where you're standing, something is moving. Oh, fun. So, yeah. I, uh, I telekinetically pass that on to Cecil with Tobias. There's something moving between her below us. And it's not know. like, and, and you know, just to make it clear, it's not like you feel it directly, but you feel like far down below. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Getting some like strong vibrations. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't say strong because the others don't necessarily feel it, but like there's something like some sixth sense of yours that kind of tells you that something is down there. Hmm. Did Cecil Lucy anything in that little cubby no, he peeked no, down? This um made you like barely empty. You guys aren't finding anything. Which, you know, having right. explored lots of, you know, various places within your time you find it really strange how empty the place is, especially given like you know, from the things so far, how complex it is. Well, I'll keep pressing onward, hugging that right side. I mean, as we're going through, am I seeing, like, tracks moving through here? Or you, um, go ahead and make another survival check. Sure. And while he's doing that, like, I, I, I begin to try and take, like, a small mental note, like, the bones and stuff. Like, a fair amount, like, like lots of people have been trapped in here, and um, died so, have been, like, so four. Or, like, after you just kind of that initial period. You yeah, I guess I haven't made You haven't found yeah. as many bones, I'd say. Okay. Um, as for tracks, you see various tracks going on in this direction. More mm -hmm. went um, forward in that path that you guys didn't take. I, I'm going to try to pass that on telekinetically. Oh. Do, yeah, do we want to keep on doing our plan of following the wall or. Um... I think so. Okay. I'm kind of at a, like another crossroads, so I'll wait for you guys. Um, but yeah, we keep hugging that right wall here, 
just, just checking out this kind of last corners. You feel like the corner is fairly mo oh yeah. You just feel like it, it's slightly mossier. Um, there's more like it's not just stone in this corner. Um, but as you oh, start looking, you don't really see anything back here. But you do see um, well, you do find it. Uh, ogre. Oh. Ogre, like fresh. Just to make sure, but it's just one. Dead. One dead. Okay. Hmm. Um, and I wouldn't say it's n definitely some time has passed, but it's not like super old, it's super fresh. Mm. Let me just... I'll, I'll, I'll kind of moan like it looks like a, it's a dead orc over here. Well, I'll, I'll go in and check. Are these uh, any like torches? Are any of them like lit as we like yeah, pass by? By the way, right now. Just because okay. I'll be like yeah. I don't actually. So yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take a look at the, the dead ogre. Get him. You find like a giant gate. Um. Can I have you also make an investigation check? Sure thing. Everybody. Not. Do well. Yes. Oh, everyone or yeah. Oh, uh, no. Just, just, uh, Tobias, since he was like... But yeah, you just noticed yeah, this shit. giant gaping hole in his chest, but... I mean, I I would like the the party to like kind of keep following me, and I'd ask like, uh, Nary, do you think the creature, whatever your sense of down below, could have done this? I point to like the hole in his chest. I'm gonna yeah catch up with him, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, would I notice anything that he hasn't seen? Make an investigation check. Sure. Da -da -da. I'm not good at those either. Much Another. better than me, though. Yeah, yeah, so as you start looking at him, so yeah, like, you came home. You mm -hmm. know where the next two dots. Ah! Oh, yeah, I'm going to definitely point that out. You notice two oh, dots of course. on the neck. Um. And you'll notice, like, around that area as well, the skin is much more, like, you know, ogres already, uh, ogres and orcs already have, like, fairly different skin tone. But um, it's much grayer around that area, and it almost seems like it was spreading through the body. But this thing is... Hmm. Okay, if we, like, wait, like, a minute, does it continue to appear like so, it's spreading? So I, I just like the way... The skin pigment in that area, it looked like it was spreading, but it, it isn't. Okay. Yeah. I wanted to make sure it's not like actually yeah, yeah, spreading. Yeah. You're, good. You're good. Okay. Cool. Um, so we go well, all the way around this little ring around the rosy. Yep. Well, I had, sorry, heading back. I'm like, that's that's not good. No. As you point out the marks. <clears throat> Did we loot that guy? Did we like look on him for shit? Oh yeah, was there anything on him? There so even with your eighteen, like he didn't have anything on him that you that you saw. I mean, that's fine. Just you know, yeah, whatever exactly. like clothes that he was wearing really. But yeah, there wasn't anything that he was carrying. Well I mean it didn't look like he was a warrior or like an adventurer. So the fact that he was just in this could have been a prisoner, for all we know. Or he could have been a meal. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> um, I guess we'll, uh, uh, we'll, get, we'll get back to here, and I'll be like, well, uh, we saw that long hallway before you guys want to head back that way, or keep hugging this wall. You guys. I mean, I did see more footprints going that way. Uh, so I don't know if you'd want to... Do you want to go in the direction of footprints, or do you want to try and avoid them for now? 
Mm. I'm unbiased. Uh, I'd like to hear Cecil if he has an opinion. No, you're not um, biased. Huh. Always, <laughs> always follow the rule. Keep going the same, the same, okay. the same thing. I'll almost like want to. There's right. no no point in in starting out with the rule if we don't intend on following it. I think makes sense. We'll keep going. Okay. Is this circle anything? Yeah, so as you um, get up to the area, you notice a large hole in the ground. Um, and if you look down, you can see that it just continues to go on and on and on and on and on. Um, you don't see it and do it, but you just see that it takes up this um, large space. I'm sorry, say that again. I totally zoned out. It is a large hole in the ground. A large hole in the ground. And got you it. Got uh, it. Down. You don't see an end to it. Okay. But, um, Joke's on you. I walk down it. Okay. Oh, I'll be right back, guys. Um, about- actually, before I do that, I'm going to hand um, whoever's closest to me like a rope. And obviously, I don't need the rope for you to, like, pull me back up, unless shit gets really bad. But I'm just doing this so that, um, like, signal. So, uh, I mean, Neri mentioned that, like, there might be some kind of big thing going on down there or something. Um, so I'll, I'll do, like, one pull if I'm, like, coming back up and I didn't really see much. Or, or if it, like, takes too long. And two if I, like, see something. So I begin to like like spider walk just vertically down uh, the pit for the time being, and maybe even I mean I guess theoretically like Zik could like fly down too. But do you, have, do you have dark vision? Yeah. All right. Well, tell us if you see anything. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, I'll pull once if I'm coming back up and I don't see nothing, and I'll pull twice if I like see something. So how far down are you gonna try to go? Let's start with that. I mean. You know, I, I walk, and then and then if if I don't run into anything after, like, you know, a minute of walking straight down, I'd probably come back up. But it just depends how big the gap is, or if I like notice any like light coming through or anything like that. So or if like traps at the bottom for all I know, maybe it's just like a spike pit. So yeah, right? as you continue uh, start going down it, you go start going down for a while and a while. And like it very slightly curves, um, is what you you're noticing, but you don't like it. Just keeps going and going, going. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna anything. like. I'm gonna like. Grab like a pebble or like something or like break off a chunk of the wall or whatever, and then like drop it. Okay. Can I have you make a uh, perception check? So as you drop, hoping to hear a sound to drop. Yeah, like roughly how long? So yeah. As you do that, the only slight problem is that it does. Speak. Um, mm-hmm. but so it's gonna keep like hitting and then dropping and then hitting yeah, and then holding kind yeah. of thing. Yeah, okay. Um, but it just keeps going. You keep hearing this um slightly echo until you can no longer hear it. But as it was going, like, it was continuously echoing and, and hitting something. Cool, cool. Hitting... If you were Does to anyone gauge... have the light cantrip? We could just cast light on a drop down the hole. I do not. Uh-huh. Um, if, like, how big would, like, the initial drop be? To... So when you say that it bends, is it, like, a diagonal bend where, like, if we jump down, we would be, like, sliding and, like, could not yeah, get up? Is or is it, like, uh, like okay. Like a slide, yeah. Okay, got it. Um, I'll pull once on the rope, and I, I begin to come back up. Um, and I'll, I'll say, like, uh, it's deep for us to venture down there all together. I drop the rock and lost the sound before I really hit the point. Um, 
but if you guys can manage to get around the gap, obviously I can if you want to keep pressing this way, otherwise we can go around. Um, I mean, you should be able to get around, right? It's just, would that just be a simple jump to get around it? You can yeah, I don't think... It. If you fall, you die. I have a feather toe. Maybe. <laughs> Do you have well, a feather toe? Um, well, I can always, like, kind of, like, hug on the wall right here and, like, pull out a hand to, like, let them, like, leap and I grab their hands and, like, spin them around and, like, swing them around the bend, too. Okay. Yeah, sure. You definitely can. Alrighty, we're over here now, fellas. We have passed Gap. Yeah, I mean, yeah. All, um, those... all right, yeah. I just used my thirteen strength score to jump over. I guess. Yeah. I do a bit of a run up. I have Zakun kind of help me across this hole. It's not full flying because it's just a step, but it's. I should be able to get around. We all... Why is this area dark? Or is that just the actual color of the map? Uh, the actual color of the map. Feel... Okay. Oh wait, this corner? You mean? Yeah, no. This, like this hallway. Uh, just, this just, hallway. Just has a darker floor yeah, for some reason. Yeah. Let's just... <laughs> yeah. there's no tor. Yeah. You can't see in that one corner, Nary. <laughs> You're like, oh, it's got to go. Um. Oops, that's my. Oh, yeah. So these walls, they don't seem very thick, do they? Mm, not necessarily. Okay. Well, we do have pickaxes. If we get sick of this shit, we could just go through 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 it. But I'm I'm <laughs> yeah. I'm happy navigating my way around thus far. Yeah. So as you guys approach more, you see another you know splinter off. So if you choose, you could go in a different direction. Change. Chesterloo's words echo in my mind as I press on. You can use that here. Sorry, that's different words that echo in your mind. As you get up to this corner, though, you do find... Um, okay. You find... Oh, that's, that's that doesn't fit. Okay. Teehee. You find... Um, sorry. You find some orcs... Um, like looking lost as well. I mean, do we like stumble on them, or are we still kind of like at least a little bit hidden? I mean, Tobias is in the lead, but yeah, you guys are technically mm -hmm. a little hidden. Um, and they're just I mean, I would imagine for the most part, I'm like kind of peering around corners and stuff as well. I'm not. I'm so like we're yeah, trying to be yeah, sneaky yeah. and stuff too. Yeah. So yeah, my I peer on the corner and I see two orcs and I, and I kind of motion back with like. A, a two and like two fingers up in the air to to the party, and and uh. Yeah, it's just here. I then told I... you it was the other way. No, you said we go here. Uh... Guys, I I point to Tobias and I say, "Come back, please, please go back." <laughs> yeah, with that, I think. Yeah. Um. I'll. Uh... Uh, I'll start coming now. Back. Now, and please, I'll, now. I'll listen, 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 listen. I'm Hurry up, back. please. <laughs> I'm coming back, but you, you'll see I'll, like, start to walk along the wall onto the roof. And so I'm, like, crouch walking on the roof. All right, that's fine. I drop my bag of caltrops, like, he here then. Okay. After and I spread past it. Right? Yeah, after, <laughs> after, I've, after we've all gone past well, it, and I spread the them roof, out so it's fine. as much like, as I can over, like, a big... Area. Dude, what if I pile drive them on the caltrops? That'd be kind of funny. I don't think caltrops actually do damage to be no. in in D and D. Maybe oh, one piercing damage. Hold on. Spread a single bag of caltrops to cover a five foot square area. Any creatures that enter the area must succeed on a DC fifteen dexterity saving throw. Stop moving and take one piercing damage until the creature regains at least one hit point. Its walking speed is reduced by ten feet. A creature moving through the area at half speed doesn't need to make the saving throw. Wow. 
There's a lot of big words. Uh, so I'll, I'll I'll put them here. I guess once we're all once we're all past it, and then we continue. And then hopefully, if we fight those orcs later on, their their movement speed is reduced by ten. Did they you know, look like they had weapons, or did they look like like what were they wearing? Um, you know, you've all fought orcs at some point in your life. They did sure. have like the most basic orc weapons. Bunch of basic bees. Yeah. So like how right, armor I've... though like looked like they would fight rather yeah. than like yeah yeah or for something. sure. Okay. I deleted okay, the right. bag of caltrops from my inventory. I've used them, and we continue. Sure. Probably staying on the roof might be a good move, to be honest. Um, yeah. Alright, fuck it. We ball. Yeah, yeah, I'll keep walking continue, uh, along the roof here. This whole stick to one side thing isn't as applicable in a map as it is in real life. Um, yeah. I mean, yeah, we can see Because we can see the map, but, like, we wouldn't be able to remember in canon. No, so. definitely not. So, yeah. as you guys keep going, you find another one of those gaping holes. Uh, this time, though, it blocks the intersection between, you know, you going forward or you going left. Does it look... It looks and, like clean, or does it look dark? Like, is there like, claw marks around the edges or anything? Make a survival check. Sure. I'm just, my mind's going back to that um, rumbling we heard. Rumbling, rumbling. Yeah. Survival? I suck at those. 14. You definitely get the instinct that some sort of creature created this. Okay, alright, well, based on the dead orc and these holes, there's some sort of burrowing shit in here. So let's try to not make vibrations if we can. Usually they go off vibrations. You gotta walk with that rhythm, so you don't attract the worm. Yeah, yeah fucking dune, bro. Gotta walk like a spastic. Mm-hmm. Alright, I do my run-up jump. Okay. I continue to walk What's... along the ceiling. Okay, Actually, I... it'd be so cute if I, like, picked up Neri by his arms and walked along the ceiling. And just <laughs> yeah, that would be funny. I, honestly, yeah. I mean, I would assume if we're not, if I'm not jumping across the center diameter, it's less than 10 feet across. So if I, like, kind of hug the walls and jump yeah, across, I could probably make it. Across, yeah. But if I, like, can I draw on this? Like it's a circle, not a not a square. So he's trying to go around the edge. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just hit like that. Yeah. Okay, because I can make I can do eight feet with a jump. <laughs> so I have weak little legs. Well, they're not um, weak for uh for a halfling. They're just weak for compared to ours because we're big and tall. However you want to. <laughs> however you want to uh, justify it. Sure. As I go, been, I go, I go around the the thing. As it's been a little bit, and Sesulu goes on ahead. Can I like press my ear to this wall to like listen in? Sure, make another perception to see check. if like to see if like maybe they've moved or yeah, go something. Ahead and make a perception check. Listening through like a foot of stone. Classic. Yeah, I'm pretty good at that. Um, you. <laughs> so you continue to hear their conversation. Pretty much. Holy, bro's got crazy ears. No, no, it's gonna literally be like. <laughs> it's just through this though, like uh, I. Animal crossing. Like crossing. I just know they're still there. <laughs> um, pretty much, what you can pick up is. They won't. Happy. Must. Okay. Stop. Damn. I suppose I didn't even do Wait. That. Everyone. Damn. Um. Yeah, uh, and then obviously Sesu like go like goes to the to the end there. But yeah, so as Sesu to catch you continue, up too. you do find another dead end. <laughs> uh, and in that one, I'll uh, yeah, I'll just say that there's like a skeleton in that one. But yeah, dude, this area. This one down here. Yeah, we'll say that I don't know that. There. 
Okay. Oh is it like? Yeah. Uh, well, I already know there's some borrowing shit in here, so I'm not gonna inspect the fucking corpse for scratch marks. All right, we continue. Jump again. Oh uh, yep. Yeah. yeah, I guess we're just going right. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, that's the fucking what's his name? Um, Bormand would have loved this shit. Yeah, but he would have gone yeah, right. That was his whole, was his whole ordeal. I remember that. <laughs> such a such a great flaw. Like probably that's one of my favorite flaw. ones I've come that's across. Such a funny is like character flaw. Yeah, actually forces different decisions because you you just have to go that way. I love it. Anyway, so we move on. Uh, we find a room. Yeah, you guys do find this room. Uh, it's like dimly lit, and you guys find that there is this like stone table, not exactly in the center of the room, but you know there is one in the room, and you do find various um, bones and skeletons spread out across this room. Okay. Scary skeletons. Are they as big as they are in? I'll say some of them are yes, in image, but some of them are, you know, more normal or size. Okay, so these are like piles and piles of fucking skeletons, right? Yeah, bones and skeletons. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. Um, what is this? Um, I was gonna ask. Yeah, go well, check out that. If you get closer, you can check it. I'm gonna get closer. Well, no, I'm I... looking from I'm looking from here. Thanks. Oh, no. I'm not. My curiosity is going to get the better of me. I want to, I want to check it out. Uh, so as you know, um, I will... It looks like a human sacrifice table, and I'm very familiar with those. Why would you think that? That's kind of rude. Um, can I have... Uh... I was going to say inspection, but that's not a thing. Um, can I have a... Either Arcana or Investigation roll from both of you. But because Sotsu is at a distance, it's going to be more difficult for you. I'm ten, I'm five feet away from the table. Yeah, yeah we're too scared to so come close. <laughs> That's just like so far away, like, I don't know. I, I think That's like, a, um... <laughs> okay. You know, right. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you're just going to like close the table and going like under it or like... Oh, I, I didn't say it was disadvantage. I was just going to say it was going to be harder for you. That's okay. I didn't roll much better without it. Um, but yeah. I rolled a 5 yeah, and a 7, so... You don't so. get anything. Nary, you... You see underneath the table... Um, they're kind of, like, tucked away, but you see various... Chains. Um, mm. And you'll notice, like... And I, I would say, like, you find at least, like four sets of chains and i would say that one of them still has a hand like a skeletal hand in it but the rest like for the for the rest of the table like through the center like there you know there's like some markings on the table but that's not like anything of note just decor but the center of the table there's like this little almost mini fire pit that's not currently active uh mm -hmm. regardless of what the image shows uh we'll say it's not currently active but you see like various dried yeah we'll say it there, there, there's a bit of dried blood on, on the table <gasps> shocking just, scandalous like, splatters of it though tiny tiny splatters. okay but as you Can... are looking at this table and investigating mm -hmm. it, you start to hear some bones wiggling and moving, and uh, I will need uh -oh. some in it. If I can find where my folder is, Teehee. Some in it. Uh, I will need some initiatives. Fucking knew it. Uh... Fucking knew it. Oh, there's no combat encounter in your current feed scene. Mm. Ah, uh, skeletons. What do you mean? Oh, spooky, <laughs> scary. Oh, oh, oh I like shit. That. That's fine. We'll fix it. Can I like 
discern the use of this table. Like, I, I am, uh, it, I from my backstory, say, very familiar I with human say, sacrifice and such. You did roll really low, initially. Like, I did, yeah, but so, I, I do know all about human sacrifice. I think if it was human sacrifice, you would know. Okay, okay so not human sacrifice, some other purpose. Yeah. We can go Combat with that. time. We can go with that. Um, what else do we want? What else do I want you guys to face? There's something you guys want to face? I don't know. You guys want to face like a dragon right now, right? Like, pretty much. Mr. Neri. I would love to fight a dragon. Not in this room, though. No, that would be Got it. Bad. Perfect. Will happen. Um, this isn't. Yeah, this is technically fine enough. Um, okay. With that, Neri, go ahead. Coolio, coolio, coolio. I'm going to have Coon pop up to that guy. I'm a, I think, yeah, I can scoot. Well, I, no, I want to take a shot first. I'm going to shoot at the one that is close to it. I put near Nary. Which one? Uh, I'm going to do this with the sharpshooter. Wait, which one? The, 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 oh, no, that one. Uh, so minus five to this. Actually, I can just do that. No, I, just minus five. Yeah. Yeah, that'll hit. So an 18. Okay. So, shit, I haven't done this since last time we played. How much damage do I add as a bonus? 10 flat. Just 10 flat? Okay. 23. Okay. So as you start, you know, running back, I guess, um, you send a shot at this skeleton. Um, you know, more of its rib cage falls off a couple, and, like, these skeletons have various amounts of arms. Um, However, it is still up and about. See? No way. We'll see. Yeah, now it's not. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take a look at that other one in the corner. And same thing. Oh, wait. Shit, minus five. I forgot to have the model, the modifier. Yeah, we'll cool. Plus ten. Twenty-three. It is still up and about. That math ain't math. And... <laughs> oh, and that's it. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Uh, okay. Coon's going to use the rest of his movement. Go over there and chomp, chomp, chomp. Try to get a nice, tasty bone take back with him. Mm -hmm. uh, that will hit. Uh, Zakun just devours this whole skeleton, gobbles it up, as he is known to do. It is no more. It has been dissolved in his stomach. Dude, are, I bet, like, skeletons are, like, chips to... <laughs> to just, like, crunch. Basically, yeah. Yeah, he began to hell calcium out of it, too. Oh, yeah. Definitely. That's how he grows. Uh, is there anything else from you? Yeah, I'm a back up behind yeah, these yeah, two. We'll that I don't want to fight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, with How much that, more movement does the Kuhn is... have, actually? Oh, is it movement not working? Or did we already go on that guy's turn? No. Hmm? Zakun just... Oh, wow. Oh, it only... It, oh, it's not adding up his movement in one turn. Okay. With that? Because, I, I mean, yeah. Okay, with that, Kuhn these skimmy gotten... tones will get a turn. They're going to uh, They're gonna start going towards this opening. They're going to move towards here. And they're going to start using their little thingies and start scratching up Setsuwu. Uh, so let me make uh, a gajillion attacks. One. No. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. <laughs> Jesus. Seven. <laughs> eight. All right. Let's see. Here. Really? Yeah, I just, four arms. I just take two of them out and I just run past you guys. Okay, you got the rest, right, guys? Okay, see ya. Um, so, like, as these guys start running at you, like, all their claws start scratching at you. These these arms are, like, tiny. They're, like, barely bigger than T-Rex arms, probably, uh, in comparison. Uh, only one of them is able to hit you. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, get ready. This will hurt so much. Oh, no. You take five damage as he just scratches your little scales. Uh, ouch. Well, there's my ten pit points gone. He also takes five cold damage. Yeah, from Armor of Agathus. <laughs> uh, with that, uh, 
Zetsu, it's your turn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Third ever green flame blade usage coming out. Hell yeah. Yeah, buddy. So close to an 14. Yeah, Yippee! Alright, one of them takes 15, and the other one takes 7. The 15 is the one that already took damage. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's and... Uh... I don't think I really need to do anything with my bonus action. I don't think there's any point in using my shove, so I'll just come over here so there's room yeah, for so Tobias to get at him. You, do is, you know, you let your sword light on fire, you slash through them both as you spin around, jump in between them, giving a space for Tobias to go in. And Tobias jumps up and starts punching! No, yeah! That hits. Uh, I think I'm still doing f lightning. Well, I can pick every time, but I, I guess it's lightning. <laughs> this one Did I notice any the skeletons taking less damage than usual things do from my attacks or anything like that? Everything seems about normal. Oh, okay, cool. Um... As I kind of jump up, as Cicely moves, I kind of like punch the skeleton in the skull like down, and it just kind of like collapses, I imagine. Yeah, sure, um, sure. And then I, I look to the other one, and I punch. Uh, that hits you. I, and then, I'm assuming he's still up. Yes. And then I will do bonus action punch. Oh man, that's that does not hit. As you punch one more time, he kind of like shoves. Uh, he kind of like sidesteps it, you know, dodging it. Um, yeah. All right, that's me. Oh shit, I need to get my laptop charger. I'll be right back, but I can still listen. Ordinary, it is your turn. Um. Well. Well, what's there? Can I see that skeleton in the corner? Yeah, sure. Okay. I'm going to have Zakun, I guess, pop over there. Because why not? I'll add the minus five here. Oh, wait. I get flanking on this, don't I? Um, well, you can't flank with ranged. Oh, there. And I'm guessing a nine doesn't? No, nine does not hit. Damn! At least it wasn't a one. That would have been dangerous. That'll hit, though. Yes. Yes, sir. Plus 10. Uh, okay, with that, it is down. Nice. Very simple combat. I'm not making you guys do much there. But yeah, that combat's over. They are just inanimate piles of bones at this point, I assume. Piles of bones. No, no loot. Maybe a little bit uh, more uh, bone dust, but yeah. <laughs> Alright, cool. Well, guys, while we were fighting those cunts, I came to the conclusion that the table is not for human sacrifice at all. It's probably some necromantic shit if there's skeletons here. If only. I mean, Tobias would know about Gaulus. <laughs> anyway, we, fo we, follow, we follow the wall. Yep, we follow the wall. Yeah, we're not is there anything... Is there anything in the wall, wall, As little wall hole? The cave. There is nothing there. All right. Well, okay. we continue. Continue on our quest. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay. Just dodging everything. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we're dodging everything. Uh, we're going right. About, don't worry about anything. We're literally going right. You're you're going the wrong way, actually. But <laughs> for a second. But yeah, like so. As you guys continue like exploring, right? Like you see how empty everything kind of just is, which is so weird. Yeah, yeah it is a bit weird. 
It's like you're used to, you know, maybe you go in a corner and some traps, some sort of, oh, I don't know, creature to fight. You, you kind of like, you guys are like ready, you know, and antsy to fight something, but like there's just nothing to. Is there anything done that? Do. Um, nah. Yeah, you guys just don't find anything to do, and you're getting like. You know, you're originally like really antsy, trying to figure out what's going on. Where, what, what's, what, you know? No, nah, bro, we're patient. We're adventurers. We've been through some shit, yeah. bro. We know, okay. we know that the shit will start sooner or later. Okay, sir. Okay. Oh shit! These walls got me fucked up right there. Yeah, you come across another. There's a room. Room, and as you are in this room, you hear, um, you know, as you come closer to this room. You begin to hear loud sounds as, like, doors are being um, slammed and metal is being tossed aside. Um, I, I message the other two and ask if they're hearing that and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I'd say everyone can. And I start, I start creeping in. So as you look in, um, let me put this in. This might change what you're doing just slightly but you see like on the and i look at the roof uh well so uh you see um we've been tricked by the classic roof monster too many times you see why is this doing it okay you see but i don't Ah, oh, fucking bastard. Wait, how did they appear out of no, nowhere? No, no, so that's, that's why you kind of went in a little bit ahead of time. I didn't think you were going in. <laughs> you were just going to peek in. But no, these are all um, here. That's what people are but yeah, you guys Which see... way are they facing? So you see that the two... Um, so as you, as you just peer in, the two orcs <clears throat> are like looking through cabinets. They're getting dinner ready? While the um, kobolds, similar to what you had just earlier faced, one of them is kind of looking up here, while the other one is like kind of scanning between this area. All right. Well, I messaged um, Neri to uh, get the jump on him and shoot. Maybe focus, focus on one, one, one can't get the jump on him. Yeah. And then we'll rush in. Yeah, do you want to like set up like a surprise round? Do I? I don't know if I do, personally speaking. I mean, I, I don't really have much to do outside of like creeping along the rooftop and hoping to fall on one of them. <laughs> yeah. What do you guys want to do here? I mean, I want to. I'll. I'll probably launch an opening volley. Um, to kind of get us started. Okay. With that, uh, I'll just let everyone roll initiative now, and then we can do, okay. just so that, like, you know, we can get to it. But yeah. You don't want to reuse our initiative? Uh, no, because I already deleted it. Holy! Oh, I suck. Oh, come on. Not one. That's rough, buddy. Damn. So, if I'm guessing just Nary is doing an opening thing, so go ahead, Nary. Uh, I mean, I would attempt a thing, but like go for it first, because it's very unlikely, like. Like, I would like to crawl along the ceiling in hopes that they don't see me, but I'm not not in the instance until he fires his arrow. So where I'm standing, just I'm on the roof of that. Okay. Ideally. Hooray. Um. Okay, with a surprise round, is there any, like, advantage or something that we I mean, have? I forget. You guys have rules surprise round rounds. rather than advantage. So. Um, yeah, I can remember. Well, it's, it's yeah. like you're hidden, I believe, right? But yeah, I don't get like sneak attack or anything, so I don't think yeah, that does like anything. I'm just giving like a full round, so yeah. Yeah. Well, no, yeah, I meant like like if a creature is surprised, given that like the status, it would be advantage, right? Yeah. It's basically, uh, uh, n well, no. So 
Surprised is like a condition that the enemy cunts have, and when they have it, they like can't move, um, and they can't like react or anything. But you don't have advantage on them purely because they're surprised if you're like uh, not okay. Th if, then... if you're not like hidden yourself. Is okay. Then the question is: Is Nary hidden to them? They have not seen him. They, they not are seen not looking. Well, if he him. if he rolled stealth and they their passive perception didn't meet the DC, then um, yes, he would be hidden. But that's up to the the craft's yeah, passive perception on them, and the stealth roll that Nary Nary had. So, okay, just normal ass. Okay, yeah. minus five. Well, if they so if they saw him, we wouldn't get surprised. So he yeah. would be he would so be think, hidden. So he would he would have advantage from my understanding of the rules. But Crafty is the DM. I mean, I'm, yeah, I'm just giving I'm you guys the full like round ahead of them to do whatever you want. Well, uh, yeah. yes, but is, so he he is not seen. Yeah, he is not seen. Correct. Then therefore he is hidden and would have advantage. Correct. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. I guess I'll try for a nat twenty, but. Yeah, whatever. Uh, which one are you shooting? Well, I mean, sharpshooter is very good with advantage, so. It is. I mean, I, I assume I already hit with that, yeah, that 23. Hits. That's already with a minus yeah, 5, but I just want to see if I get a nat 20. He's, yeah, that hits, though. Yeah. I don't. So, whatever. Sharpshooter, that. Yeah, so, when you when you say you're giving us the whole round, that's just like, they are skipping their turn because they're surprised, pretty much. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna re-roll. So that first one's the piercing damage. I'm gonna re-roll that. Okay. Because I have piercer. Me. So an extra three damage. So eleven on. Oh, so twenty-one on that dude. Twenty-one. Okay. Uh, that one just instantly falls. So like as you just shoot it, it just slumps over on the on the countertop that it's uh looking at. It is just instantly down. Nice. So I think now that I've fired an arrow, I'm no longer hidden. Correct. For a second attack. Yeah. I think that's how that works. Yeah. Whatever. Um, okay, so I'm gonna attack this cobalt next, just because that's what my, my position is. Oh my god, I thought I was charging my laptop. I never plugged it in. Oh no! Are you gonna die? <laughs> okay. Sharpshooter again. Oof. Fourteen on the cobalt. That will hit. Thank you. I was yeah hoping. The sharpshooter gober. Twenty. Jesus. Okay. Yeah. That. That. Yeah. That does a lot. That one's dead too. Uh. No. It is still up. Uh. How about now? It is still up. Damn. Uh. Okay. How about now? Well, Zakun has to hit. Ah. First. Um. <laughs> yeah. Zakun misses. Ha having been shot, starts looking around and it sees Zakun and just in time. It's able to dodge the coon's bite. Okay. With that, um, who's uh, after? Sisu, you're technically after. Uh, okay. Did Tobias so, have it? I mean, yeah. If Tobias wants to do something as well, because I know. Oh yeah, what I, what I would have, like, or... what I will be doing yeah, is like, I was gonna walk over and then fall onto this guy. Sure. Um, so you said their ceilings are 12 feet, right? Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's not going to be much, even if it works. So, I'm going to fall on this creature. So, he needs to make, a, I think it's like a DC 15 deck save. Uh, the, which one? The, okay, that one. The kobold. Okay. Oh, like on a creature. Hold on, let me double check. I think it's just 15. <laughs> Uh, uh, it will save. Okay. I I will then just slow fall, so I don't take damage. Um, and then I will punch. He is he's he's aware of our presence now. At I'm this point, yeah. I don't think you can punch. melee someone the way you're doing it and be stealthy. <laughs> 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 Literally tries to like pile drive like ah! <laughs> off the ropes and like still doesn't That'll see hit. me. Yep, this is lightning. Okay. 
And then, oh wait, I guess I'm not on his tile. I'll just be here. Yeah. And then, uh, he's still up, so I will try and punch him again. Pong! That'll hit. Alright. Okay, come on. Okay. Still up. He's, alright. Boom. Yeah, might as well. Um... I will spend a key point uh, and fury. Give me one second. Fury of blows. Consume resource. Um, as I you know, launch off the ceiling and just start wailing on this dude. You just aren't having it with these guys, but yeah, that hits. Okay. Okay, it is still. And he's up. up. All right, last one. That'll hit. Mm -hmm. Uh, it is still up. Oh my god! This guy's from hell. Um, on this last one. Okay, hold on. I don't want a meta game. This is literally by definition meta gaming, and I'm, that's why I'm asking you now. I was considering starting striking him, and I would for certain do that, knowing he's a vampire spawn now. So therefore, do I know he's a vampire spawn? I mean, it's identical. Now that I've been close to him and put. Okay, cool. To, you know what you guys just fought outside. Okay, very cool. <laughs> um, I will on that last punch. Go for a little stunning strike. So I need to consume. Where is it? Damn, I was uh, not expecting the kobolds to have more health than the goddamn orcs. Right. All right. He needs to make a DC 14 con save, or this dude's stunned. He and that kind of is a low DC. He will save. Yeah. Sad. Yeah, I mean, I can't really. I mean, I have a 16 wisdom. I kind of feel like that's pretty good for a monk. Yeah, that's true. Uh, but sad. Yeah. I'm not. Uh, I'm not wasting. I'm not wasting a silvery barbs on this little one little guy. You're good. You're good. We're also surprising them. So that with that, that is that is me. Except maybe I'll stand like here, so I'm maybe flanking if Cecily wants to attack him. Do we play flanking rules? Yeah, we Just what, plus I thought two? we were doing plus two. Yeah, we have plus two. Yeah. Oh. oh okay. Also, right. I have to imagine I'll use the that, shit like, out of that after after I missed like the or the, the 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 like falling on him, I like you know slow fall. Maybe did like a landed on my back. And then like threw myself back up on the ground and started just punching him like four times in a row. Okay. Uh, with that. Uh, Damn, I guess that's who we can your turn. Then we'll be in actual initiative order, technically. Um, okay, I go over here and I, uh, Booming Blade. Okay. Um, where's my character sheet? Here it is. Spellbook. Yeet. Seventeen. That'll hit. Cool. Eighteen damage. This guy is going down. Sweet. I uh, I just go. Yeah, I'll go through through the back of his. Pardon me. Through the back of his fucking head. Uh -huh. With the the flat the the blade flat. Mm -hmm. He's dead. And then I pull it out, and I like flick it backwards, and the blood splatters across the wall like an edgy anime man. No. Okay. And then I uh, shove this guy five feet okay. away from me uh, with telekinetic. It's a strength save against 15 from memory. That will save. Let me post that bitch. It saves. Uh, cool. All right. Um, that is. My turn, I will come over here, though, at the end of it. That, we will start actual initiative order. Uh, so, the one in front of Zakun will get its turn. 
it will start to bite Zakun. Dude, fucking vampire spawn, bro. And as Zakun tries to like dodge it, it's able to get on, uh, bite one of Zakun's wings. Damn. Uh, that will be nine damage to Zakun. Okay. Uh, does he have any of that other stuff that is happening to him? Yeah, so Zakun's HP is reduced by four. Damn. As you start to see, you know, um, you had shot at this one? Yeah, you had shot at this one. Some of its wounds yeah, that one has some start to close. Damn. With that, it'll be Tobias's turn. All right. I got 50 movement, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. Um, I will punch. That'll hit. All right. Um, now go. No, it's fine. It is still up. As you start punching, yep. not allowing its extra attack holes to reclose, I guess uh, that'll still hit. Uh, and uh, now it is down. Oh shit! No way. Nice. Uh, I believe I should still have a tiny bit of movement left, so I'll come over to this one, and then I will bonus action just regular punch. That'll hit. Dude, I rolled like 11 like <laughs> for all my attack rolls. So, as you start punching this one, Tobias, mm -hmm. you start get punching one, him one in good the chest, and you start seeing, like, you know, it dents, like, you know, you know your strength. But as you start mm -hmm. denting it, immediately afterwards, you just see it fix itself. What? Okay. You seem to have not done anything to it. By fix itself, like, like, like... You, so you saw, like, you know, when you punched him, you saw the impact, you saw, like, a little, you know, crater, a little dent on his chest, and as you put mm -hmm. you pulled back your fist, you saw, like, his chest start to fix itself, and, like, the dent started to go away, and, like, started being, you know, more normal-shaped. Uh, um... Hold on, how much key do I have? I don't want to stun him. Costs two key. I got five. Nah, I'm chilling. Uh, but I'll shout back and be like, something's up with this one. Okay, with that, Nary, it's your turn. So, dope. Coon's gonna move over there. I'll move over here. I'm gonna make this my favorite foe. Okay. Which is what? Just doing an extra d6, I think. Yeah. Is it? 1d4. Whatever. Whatever. Um, is that per turn or is that each time? I'd... First, yeah, once per turn. Uh, whatever. Structure to this guy. Uh, 13. Will hit. Nice. Your favorite foe should be 1d6 damage. by now. My what now? Your favorite foe should be 1d6 by now. Oh, okay. I guess this thing just has not updated uh, yet. 14? Yeah, that'll... Or new sharpshooter. 24 plus a d6. This is going to be the favorite foe. And, and you also have a sharpshooter, not... right? So... Okay. Yeah. So yeah, it's... instantly goes down. Slumps over instantly. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Not... All that damage? Yeah. I didn't... Okay. Well, he, he seemed like he's regenerating. So, yeah. Whatever. <laughs> Okay. Uh, must have must have just been a weak punch or something. That was strange. That, you guys are out of combat again. Huh. Huh. Damn that guy. So what was up with that guy? Was he just like, can we can we like check his gums? Like uh, when you're checking a dog a dog to see if it's healthy. Yeah, like can so we you, see if he's got uh, vampire fangs? So you, you know, check his gums. Like I'm not gonna make you to check his gums because you're literally checking his gums but you do see more prolonged teeth up in front uh akin to yeah. that, uh, 
Interesting. <clears throat> um, is there anything in these cabinets that they were looting? They are cabinets from memory, yeah, not tables, yeah. right? Uh, so as you start looking through them, you see, you know, various pots and pans. Um, roll a, just a flat d20 for me. Sure. Two. Uh, you do not find anything in that cabinet. Yeah, yep, one, figured. That one is empty. I would have actually rolled a one if you asked me to roll investigation, so... Uh, anything um, this cabinet is empty, guys. Also, should we be like... I don't know anything about vampires. Tobias, you seem to... Uh, can these guys come back to life? I've heard some shit about vampires. Should we be like chopping off their heads or I like know, baking them I to the didn't floor? I crush them in last time just for for worry's sake. I've heard you gotta spike them or stake them with a wooden stake. Yeah, that's what I heard. Unfortunately, yeah. I don't have any. I mean, realistically, if this is anything like me, which I presume it to be, I'm not immortal, so I, I've just kind of oh, crushed their skulls in just in case. Yeah, like me. <laughs> what, what do you? You've, you've seen oh, my yeah. people's <laughs> bags. <laughs> He's like, the fuck? <laughs> no, All right, just, well, I guess I... have been looking away the, every single time you've done it. Just can yeah, you... for sure, for sure. I guess yeah, I... Yeah. Chop their heads off, then. Okay, sure. Yeah, go for it. Sure. Um, I wonder if those other orcs were fucked up, too, then. Probably that, because they haven't been over here yet. Um. Well. Shall we? Sure. Uh, I mean, just because it's right here, like, there's this big room, you know, I peer ahead in again. Wait, sorry, did we, did we check this? Is this another cabinet over here? Uh, you guys didn't look there, but you could. Yeah, I'm a dead before we leave this room. For me. But yeah, D20. Tobias, you just see um, another room in the back, and you see, like, in this room, you do see in the back um, the body of two more orcs and one more kobold. But they're gone. Uh, yeah, Nara, you find nothing in that cabinet either as well. Figured! But yeah, you find, um... Yeah, you do find in the back of this room that you see up front, Tobias, uh, two more orc bodies and a kobold body. Uh, uh same thing. I'll, I'll kind of ch check their, you know, see if they're a bit, or if they've been converted. Um, you see that, yes, they have been bit but you don't si see any signs of life from them. And kind of like that first mm -hmm. body that you saw, you see that, like, um, where they were bit, there's, like, a patch of, like, gray that seemed like it was spreading. All right, uh, chop the heads off, move on. Yep. That's not good, that's not good. But yeah, let's, uh, we'll do that, and we'll, uh, you guys want to, are there the same cabinets as well, more cabinets? Yeah, more cabinets. I'll open a, I'll open a but cabinet. Like, but like, these ones, the cabinet doors are wide open, and like, you can see that there's, like, nothing inside, and like, in the middle of this room are like, all the pots and pans. Maybe there's like, a little box as well, that's been emptied in the center of this room. Oh, like There's nothing down here, I assume. I walked, walked, I, I, I walked through there. There's nothing. Shame. But yeah, you guys continue to walk around, running into more and more dead ends. Curious about what other things work in this area. Um, but yeah, you just keep going and finding dead ends. It's fairly empty, you know, as you keep finding. Um, yeah. 
keep moving around. You know, you just keep going, Setsuo. You just don't find anything, and and it's just weird. Yeah, I know it's pretty weird. It's weird how empty this is. I don't know if you want to play was some toilet kind device of to catch up. <laughs> I'm, coming, I'm, coming, I'm coming. We're not hearing any of those like orcs we left behind. No. Nope. We haven't heard any of, like nope. noise or anything. Yeah, they like scream and did it echo through the cave if they stepped on the cow traps or anything. <laughs> yeah. But as you all, you know, you continue on and on and on. Guys, there might be a thing up here. No way. I peek around the door like the little gif I posted. Yes. So yeah, as you uh, peek around, you find this little, little, you find this bigger chamber, and it's, in a sense, kind of similar to the original chamber, the, the first chamber that you guys saw, with, like, all those, like, snap end. This but map is... It is. With, uh, as well. uh, rather than this bull's head, it is going to be a snake's head up here. Ooh. Um, you see two metallic gates in the back. Do I uh, like recognize the the type of snake or like Can what I it's representing? Check? Sure. Uh, re 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 plus two. Thirteen. Oh my god, guys, this is this is crazy shit here. Not really, it's just like a temple, pretty, probably pretty unrelated to the, the weird shit that going on with my my shit. Seems pretty well read. Anyway, um, yeah, we we continue with the the path following, but like maybe we explore this room. Oh. Um, I look on the roof. Is there any roof monsters? <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Uh, but... It's not a bad question. To ask. I know. <laughs> I I can. Is this like uh, all these bones cannon? Uh, I will say it's not that. Just are... Okay. Can I see any like put together skeletons still in the corners uh, that are gonna like fuck rise up and attack us? Uh, as of right now. You Okay, why are you smiling? I don't know what you... We can I can hear, hear it in your voice. voice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, I'll, like, ready a fucking... I don't know, like, a firebolt or an ash blast if one of them pops up as a ready to action. And then, uh... And, yeah, I guess we... We all go and investigate the big altar. So What's the deal? Are these this room. You begin to see a large hole see. appear in front of you. A large creature appears, which is where we're gonna end. Dude, you must jazz. Oh my god, can can we see the can we see the token before we have, we... A, we have a token? Yeah, so we know like we know what we're up against. Ah, uh, that's okay. That's right, guys. 